Hey, welcome to Graphic Policy Television, GPTV. I'm Brett. In my hands is Beyond the Breach, number two. This is a surprising issue. Um, we'll get to that in a minute as to why. Uh, it's written by Ed Brisson. Damien Cusiero is the artist. Patricio Del Pesce is the colorist. Sasan Etzmin Elu is the letterer. Um, all right, so this is what surprised me. So the this overall story is it's kind of like a dimensional rift happens as this girl's driving in California. She's besieged by all these strange creatures and... and um, you know, has to fight for survival. That was kind of where the comic ended. This one picks up from that as she uh, fights for her life and she comes across a stranger named Samuel who rides a giant tortoise uh, who saves her. Um, we learn a little about a bit what's going on. Like, there's clearly some dimensional breach that might be more than just one. Uh, and what's, I think, really interesting is where the issue goes from there. It kicks us into unexpected directions. Uh, by the end of it, it was not what I was expecting at all. It was a very surprising uh, issue in a good way. Like, this was, this is one of those where, like, oh, I think it's just going to be a survival and someone trying to escape and maybe get out of this weird uh, nexus, whatever you want to call it. And, yeah, there's, there's way more going on than just that. So, uh, this was a surprising, surprising issue. Like, really, really caught me off guard in a good way. So, I mean, this is a, a good issue in that um, the first one, you know, I thought was was good. Uh, you know, it didn't super excite him, but I thought there was a lot of a lot of small details that I really liked. This one is good for a whole other reason. Like it's it's really really good in that it surprised me. It really really caught me off guard um, and went in direction I wasn't expecting at all. So I mean, the the fact that I can read a comic and it does that, I think, is a really good thing. Any comic that kind of keeps its readers on its toes is is a solid thing. Um, the art, I think, continues to be pretty solid. You know, it, it, the art, I, I would say, it doesn't quite blow me away, but it's good. Um, you know, it it's very I, serviceable. Sounds rude, like mean or all that, but it, it does it does a really good job of depicting the story, the weird world. Um, you know, it doesn't dive too much into the weirdness. Um, in that, like, it doesn't linger on it. It just kind of all blends it all together really, really well. And I, I think in that way. The art is solid. Um, it, it really does a good job of kind of bringing these worlds together and, and doing it in a seamless way. Um, and it doesn't go heavy with like a, hey, look at this weird thing over here. It, it, it really, it does a good job of, of um, pacing out all of that. So really good issue. I like it. Uh, it surprised me from the first issue. It went in a direction I wasn't expecting. If you were kind of on the fence with that first, after the first issue, go pick up the second one. I think you'll, you'll be pleasantly surprised. Uh, out now at comic shops, so you can go get it. We got a link beneath this video. Put in your zip code, tell the shops near you. No shop, no problem. We have some affiliate links. There are affiliate links. We get a small percentage by doing that. You help support our site. So thank you. Uh, speaking of support, I want to thank Aftershock for coming up with the review copy. And of course, thank you all for watching. If you're into comics, if you're into Aftershock, check us out every single day at graphicpolicy.com or on Twitter, Facebook, YouTube, Tumblr, all at Graphic Policy, keeping it nice and consistent. Until next time, keep reading those comics and keep it geeky. Hey, thanks for watching the previous video from Graphic Policy Television. Just by watching, you help support our site. Thank you so much. Now, if you're watching these videos, you probably care about geeky things like movies, television, comic books, toys, games, video games, you name it. You can go and subscribe right now to our YouTube channel to stay in touch and catch all the new videos, or check out our website at graphicpolicy.com. There's a nice link on this end of the video. But as always, thank you for watching. Keep on rocking and keep it geeky.